Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to today's video and we're going to be checking out a goddamn BEA beautiful mod made by Zoidberg. This guy has made some of the best house mods. He always knocks them out of the park and this one looks to be just as goddamn good and pretty goddamn impressive. So this is called the Life Invader Mansion made by Zoidberg. Link is in the description. Check this bad boy out if you want to. It's so big and so detailed that I'm getting like 20 frames per second, 20 FPS bro, 20 FPS and I have like a GTX 980 Ti, uh, I have a freaking like one of the top CPUs, uh, CG bullshits and uh, it's still, it's still um, a bit laggy, not laggy, just low FPS, so anyway, I guess let's have a, let's have a little bit of a look, it might be a little bit laggy, so, or like just, just choppy, look at that thing, what the fuck, so the security everywhere, I had, there's two versions with it, one without people and one with people, so maybe it's a little bit better on FPS without people. Look at the size of that. Damn. Damn. Look at it. Alright, well, let's head inside. This this guy makes some of the most craziest houses. Can I even get through this fence? Yes, we can. So, security for days. Look at the security. God damn. So, we're going to have a look at the garage first, just because it's the first level by the looks of things. Down here, we got our own little mechanic. Look at him. Ready to fix up all my problems. Bunch of extra car um, freaking rims. You know, if I want to change my rims, I tell this guy, boom, he's going to put some on. Here's my car setup or car garage. Look at that. There's tons of these cars. you got, like, just normal cars all the way to, like, really exotic looking stuff. So, pretty goddamn impressive. All right. I like that. So, we can go up through there, but I don't want to go through there. I want to go through the main doors and we can kind of figure our way out uh, from there so let's go upstairs look at this this is your entrance if this is my entrance to my house i'd be like i've done pretty well in life now i just got jail cells that's my entrance dude all right here we go look at the wow this is the massive so so there's the stairs to the garage this is just a massive walkway uh we can go up like there's so many different wow there's a ton of stories okay holy shit i guess let's just go through this door this is the only door we can go through so let's have a look what's in here Oh, okay, so in here, there's a bloody strip club or something going on here. A bunch of bunch of chicks doing some uh, doing some pole dancing. Yeah, this is a like a, like a, like a little strip club. Look, all the businessmen are here. All all the main players. We got Michael, Franklin. Uh, I think we got Lamar over here as well. Trevor. Uh, we got all the those uh, FIB assholes. Everybody, look 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 at us trying to trying to. Source this girl up, trying to talk her up, you know, get get in her panties. We have a, you know, bartender as well. And then a personal DJ here as well. So this, this is pretty lit. Look at this huge ceiling. It's like, damn. And then obviously the views are pretty good as well here. Look at that. Look at those views. Jesus Christ. Those are to die for. So that's pretty goddamn awesome. So we only can go through, this is the first, I like the first room you enter, so you enter the house, the first doors you enter through, strip club, that's my type of house my friend. Let's make our way up to the next level and see where this, oh you can see like there's a little window through there so you can see the ladies doing their yoga exercises of course. So we've got a couple more doors here so I guess we can go through the, damn there's so many doors. This first one here is, what? <gasps> It's a basketball court. No freaking way. Jeez. There's an actual full side. Look, you can sit down there and watch people. Wow. Indoor basketball court. Holy. That's... <laughs> that's nice. Through here is like the showers and the lockers. Pretty cool. You obviously would need to stop stuff for basketball, right? You know, the players can change here, take showers and all that good stuff. There's so many areas we can go. We can go through there. Let's go through these two doors, see what this is. Go through this one first. And it's a toilet. It's a little toilet. Okay, what about this one? Is this a toilet too? Oh, it's another toilet. So I guess that's like a boys and girls type of toilet, you know. Through here, we have two doors as well. Let's go through this one first then. This is the kitchen area. Yep, this looks like the chef area. Keep in mind, one thing the guy said, this house is not finished. The only reason... It's not finished is because he wasn't able to upload any more stuff. Basically, he's reached the limit of objects, so some rooms aren't finished. For example, like this one. I'm 100% sure if this was, you know, if he was able to add more objects, he would make this room a lot more detailed because at the moment he just has like a, you know, like a kitchen and two fridges. So uh, it's, it's, it's just a little bit of a heads up. Some of the rooms might not look 
uh, super detailed, but this guy makes some serious good, list, good stuff. So through here, we have an enormous, enormous freaking dining table. What is this? Look at the size of this. You can like the, the views here is pretty crazy as well, like the windows and the, the sheer size of some of these rooms are insane. Look at this. Damn, damn, damn. I'll be damned, my friend. Look at that. Huge. This is bigger than my house. This is bigger than a house I'm living in. This one room. Holy cow. All right, let's go up. Up a level. Uh, seems like next level. Here we go. Look how many levels there are still. There's one, two, three more levels. What the fuck? We haven't got a receptionist on level two or level three. What level am I on? I don't even know what level I'm on. There's a receptionist here. Like, what? Let's go through these doors. What the hell is this? So, we got a bunch of security here. All the way down here. What the hell? Is that an elevator? Where, do, where am I going to be taken? Okay. So, that opens up and I go through here. And, oh, I can have a boat. I can have some fun on the lake. And look, that stuff opens when I get close to... Wow. That's really cool. So, I can have some fun on the lake. Damn, I'll be damned. And you can get back up here and then... That's crazy. That's actually crazy. Alright, so we're going to have a look at these rooms down here first. This is the upstairs area of the basketball court. So you can actually, you know, drink some beers here and probably watch some basketball if you really wanted to. You can kind of like sit here. If you don't want to be down there, I suppose, right? Some nice detail here. Big ass couch, drinks, and a huge, 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 huge. It's actually not that huge. It's, but there is some drinks down here. So that's pretty nice. Down for this door is... Whoa, humongous conference. Wow, this kind of reminds me. I don't know about you, but this straight up reminds me of like some kind of world domination kind of room, you know, like the the the, the presidents of the, of the world, you know, kind of like come together or something of, you know, uh, they, they, they like the mass villains come here and they decide how to destroy the planet Earth. This is pretty crazy, but you got to remember, this is the Life Invaders um, house. So I guess like, you know, like the Facebook kind of version, Life Invaders is similar stuff. Look at this. How, Jesus Christ. That's pretty impressive. Massive conference room, big ass chandelier. Views are pretty nice. They're like, God damn, what the fuck? This is insanely good. Like, I'm impressed. This guy, every single time he's made a house mod, it's insanely phenomenally good. Like, damn. Holy Daniel. And then we have a little bit of a room here as well. We can. Oh, it's a safe. Bunch of weapons on the wall. Security guard here. Looking at all the cameras and stuff, so through the safe here, probably a little bit of a, like, uh, there we go, a little bit of a, I guess, I was gonna say armory, but it's not, that's not what it is, it's kinda like a bunch of money and gold here, armory was outside, so, you can see here, it's got paintings, and silver, and like, egg, gold, and just straight up cash. This guy, whoever owns this, this businessman, is a bloody multi-billionaire, like, Jesus Christ. So we have looked at all the rooms. Let's go upstairs to the next. Gee, are we nearly done? Holy cow. I guess let's just go through. This room is one of the offices. This could be the main guy's office. So that could be the Life Invaders guy. So that could be the main uh, dude. I guess that is the main guy who owns Life Invaders, I suppose, right? That makes sense. He's kind of standing next to the thing. Giving an interview to one of these, these guys. I don't know what they're talking about. They could be talking about their dick sizes, for all I know. But he's got a bunch of desks here. Maybe that's his assistant that could sit there. That's his desk here. So you can see the views outside. To be honest, I'd have my desk at the other end so I can see the views in the city. Because the city views are nicer than these views, you know. I don't know. That's just me, though. Bunch of details everywhere looking super nice. Got drinks, coffee, everything you need. So is there any rooms through here? It kind of looks like they're... Ooh, nearly just fell down. Okay, yeah, there is. There's two rooms. So, so let's have a look what's in here. Boom! Inside here, we have... A bedroom yes this is the first bedroom so nice little office area bedroom kind of thing it's still pretty big the bedrooms massive look at the couch here this couch is like to like 10 plus people crazy there's another couch here so you look at the views that comfy ass chair so you can look at the views bed a TV there's all pretty goddamn nice bed room bed room my friends so across here I'm gonna guess another bedroom Yep, it's another bedroom, a different style though, different sofas as you can see here. Pretty much the same kind of layout, but I like that the guy used different objects. Like, uh, you know, there's another sofa. It's, it's all very similar, but like different objects, so it looks different. Like the sofa color and everything like that is pretty different, so that's nice. The only thing missing here, I guess, is uh, toilets and stuff like that, so I don't know where to go. They'd, they'd have to go all the way downstairs to pee, you know what I mean? But uh, that's not that big of a 
issue. It doesn't have to be, you know, realistic because this is still super impressive. All right, next level, we're up again. What's through here? This is a... Holy shit, it's a bedroom! Okay, so you can see the... Co oh, wow. oh, wow, wait a minute. Holy crap, this is a huge bedroom. So, through the door we come here. So, this is the first door here. It's a toilet. All right, I like that. You can sit there, poop. Very nice. And then you come through here. You're actually greeted with the bed. Very nice. And this one does have a... But it looks like things a bit, uh, bathroom and a toilet. So, here's the bathroom. Separate toilet. I like that there's doors. So, you know, if you have a bad, bad poop, you don't smell out your whole room of poop. Because it's kind of behind the door. And then you can... Ha you, what kind of a bedroom has downstairs? You have to go all the way downstairs to get to your, like, you know, TV and sofa. That is so fucking cool. Sit here. You go, yo, that's crazy. And then you're... This is what I would have. I'd have my desk, like, looking out there. Because that is a really, really nice view. Considering how old is GTA? Like, what, like, maybe five, no, five years plus? Four? I don't know how old it is now, GTA 5. That is really fucking good looking game to this day. Damn. I do like that. That's awesome. That's very, very nice. So let's uh, go and explore the other rooms. This is impressive, guys. Are you impressed? You should be. If you are, make sure you leave that like, um, like button, guys, because this is goddamn impressive. Download it yourself. This guy makes great house mods. One of the best. Definitely one of the best for the house mods. So we're just going to go through this room as well. And I presume there's another bedroom here as well. Similar layout. Yeah, pretty much exactly the same layout, but uh, uh, there's going to be different objects that are used by the looks of things, which is fine. I'm not... Yeah, it, it, pretty much the same bedroom layout, which is fine. Doesn't bother me. It's still freaking there. It looks awesome. Impressive. So we still have another two levels or one level potentially, but there was a door... Wait, I'm confused here. So we came through there. So these doors down here. What's this? This is a personal little gym. Nothing too crazy here, but everything you need. You got your, you know, squat racks, free weights. You got your freaking uh, benches. You know, you got your chest uh, bench press. You got your running machine, bike machine. Got some TV. Good, believable gym right here. Through the other door, we have a green screen area, recording, broadcasting area. Makes sense. It's a life invader house, so the guy might have to do some kind of, you know, work here, videos, so... Pretty fine, looking looking good. And upstairs, I think we're on the final level by the looks of things. Yes, we are. Holy cow. So we're going to have a look at this stuff here in a second. So we've got a helicopter pad over here on this side. Damn, very, very nice. And down here we've got jacuzzis and a bunch of ladies. Of course, Michael's daughter would be in a jacuzzi trying to attract, uh, trying to attract some penis. Dirty, dirty, dirty girl. Down here we've got some ballers over here doing some stuff. You know, talking some business, as you can see, the rich guys. Uh, I can't remember their names now, but uh, it's pretty lit. Over here is another helicopter as well, and it's covered in gold. This guy is filthy rich. Filthy rich. And there was a door over this way, so let's have a look what's through here. Anything? Eva bloody go. we got a nice little table area here. Wait, this area is pretty big as well, so what the hell is this? Is this a massive bedroom? Is this the final bed? Oh, damn. So there's... There's five bedrooms, I think. That's impressive. So this must be the master bedroom. It's like a freaking dining table. Huge TV area with the freaking setup of the tables and chairs. Behind here is a nice bed, which looks huge. You can look out there, looking nice and sweet. Then on this side, you have a massive closet. Huge wardrobe closet. Like, god damn, this is huge. This is like bigger than my room. IRL. Twice as big. Maybe three times. And down here... Is the bathroom area, which has jacuzzi, uh, huge shower, bath, and the toilet in there as well. What the fuck, this guy is rich. Can I be your friend, please? Can I just come over? Can I just have a house tour? Like, I'm jealous. Do you know what one annoying thing would be like that? When your room's all the way at the, the top, so you have to go all the way down here. Every day, you have to walk all the way down the stairs. Like, that'd make me cry. Imagine bringing up anything to your room. I couldn't be freaking asked. I'd be like, you know what? Screw it. I'm not doing it. Well, I'll be damned. There it is. The unbelievable, unbelievable Life Invaders mansion. And this is 100% a mansion. I mean, look at the sheer size of it. It looks unbelievable. It really does look super fucking cool. All the angles look really cool on it as well. It's just... What the hell? I'm impressed. That was really, really good. Damn, damn, damn. That's got to be in like the top five best house mods. Jesus Christ. Well, 
the last thing left for us is to get rid of this and uh, I guess see what this appears. I mean, let me know what you think, guys. I'm very impressed with this. This house is insanely good. Very, very nice. Very detailed. Good looking house. So we're going to get rid of this baby and see what this appears. I'm trying to get like a nice view of it all so we can see. But here we go. Let's zoom out so we can see the little driveway and everything as well. So that will be good. Here we go, guys. On the count three. One, two, three. And bam. There she goes. Holy cow. That's impressive. I'll see you next video, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for joining. That was awesome. One of the best, hands down. I'll see you next video, guys. And uh, let me know what you think, guys. Have a good day. Bye.